Hey everyone, Technomancer with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix your payment decline on your iPhone issue. So let's get started. So first thing is if you're having an issue where the payment is being declined, you want to go into your setting of your iPhone, click on your Apple ID here, and from there on you want to check into payment and shipping here. So click on payment and shipping. Now what we want to verify here is that the billing address we have on the file is correct. And if you recently moved or relocated, you want to make sure that address is updated and it's the same card that you have for the card. Next thing you want to do is if you already have a card here, you can try to remove that card and re-add it again to make sure that it is working. And if you have multiple cards, same exact thing. The ones that's getting declined, just remove it and then simply re-add that as well. Now after you have now after you have done the checking the billing address and uh, deleted or removed and re-added the card itself the next thing you want to go ahead and do is force restart your iPhone to do that you're going to press and release the volume up press and release the volume down so you're going to do volume up volume down and then hold on to the side button just like that make sure you press volume up and down quickly before holding on to the side button and we're going to force it to completely shut down and then keep on holding that side button until the Apple logo appears so after that, we let go of that side button, and that is just shutting down the phone software, reloading the code. So if it's a software-related issue causing the phone to decline your payment, it will fix it. This method will not delete any of your personal data, so all of your photos, videos, apps, everything will be safe. Just will give it a fresh restart again. Now after you do that, the next thing you want to do is go into your settings, go to general software update, and check if there's a software update available. Sometimes what happens is a previous update might have caused some issues and the new update will fix that for you and it's going to be one of the things you want to do. And if there's an update, go ahead and update it now. Now after doing the software update, you're still having the issue. It's going to be most likely an issue that's on your card side, so a card issuer. So you have to call the company that you have the card with to make sure there isn't an insignificant balance. If they didn't lock your card or any issues with your card, sometimes it can happen and that's why it's getting declined because if the billing and the card that you have on file on the iPhone is correct, it's most likely the, the company blocking it or preventing that transaction going through. So give them a call to see what's going on. And hopefully after doing that, your card issue is fixed and do share with us how you fixed your card issue, whichever worked in the comment section. And I hope this video is helpful. So uh, thanks for watching guys. See you guys next time.